six. If we were to open the doors tomorrow, I'm sure we would have way more than we could handle. But that's not in their plans just yet. Farmer City Raceway says under phase three of reopening, they could start racing again. If they did, though, there wouldn't be any fans there. And the track says it wouldn't make sense financially for them to do it without them. WCI3's Andy Olson looks at what they're doing to wave the green flag as soon as possible. The sound of two dozen engines battling on the dirt of Farmer City Raceway has been missing on Friday nights. The track normally opens its season in early April. With COVID-19 restrictions, the quarter mile has sat empty for one of the longest spans since it opened in 1938. But they've been working to come up with a plan to race and have fans in the stands. And there's, just, there's a lot of hoops to jump through, a lot of protocol that's got to happen. And again, we understand the being safe and, and doing all of the safety stuff to keep everybody safe. But at the same time, this is central Illinois. This is, you know, <laughs> the country where, th thank goodness, we haven't had any, any cases and, and we feel pretty, pretty safe here. DeWitt County has reported four positive cases during the crisis. The track has made some money from some individual testing and tuning sessions. They say that has gone towards insurance and keeping the lights on. But some drivers have been affected by the pandemic as well, which could lead to fewer drivers on the track. Normally by now, you know, we've received most of our sponsorship money from the year and, and we've used that to, to buy tires and things along those lines, fuel, oil, all those things we need to, to run week in and week out. Um, and right now, you know, businesses just can't support us in that way. There's no estimate for when racing will return. The track says it's going to let others in the state be the first ones to try and open. But as soon as they can get a plan approved, they'll be ready to be back on Friday nights. Farmer City's heritage is between our, our racetrack and our horse track and, and even our BMX track. So it's racing is definitely what Farmer City's on the map for. In Farmer City, Andy Olson, WCIA3, your local news leader. One of the drivers at Farmer City has plans to race this year, but he won't have any sponsorship backing. He says he's donating the space on his car to his previous sponsors who've been impacted by the crisis. All right, Brett is here.